Hey you guys, it's Peter, and I'm back. Of course I'm back, I'm not going anywhere. Beast, I'm YouTube famous now, available in 2018, the album, Dad AF. I put a spell on you, and now you're mine. And today, we've got a very special guest with us, Trisha Peters. Hey, what's up, you guys? <laughs> <laughs> We're doing a classic mukbang dressed as two YouTubers. Because last year we did two YouTubers, remember? Yes, I remember. <laughs> we did. <laughs> you look so ridiculous, it's so hard to like talk to you. Oh, we got mukbang here. My dog. Wait. <laughs> so, we thought it would be a fun idea for Halloween to do a mukbang dressed as Peter Mon and Trisha Paytas. And especially that she's the mukbang queen. And you can see we got the mukbang and chill shirt on. <laughs> and um, I got my fan. I've got my chapstick. Hold on. Okay, I put on my chapstick like Peter Mon. And unfortunately, sorry Trisha, if you're ever watching this, sorry we did not get Domino's. We we ended up just getting like a local pizza from Miami. I guess the hardest part is going to be eating with this. So we're going to link up last year's video. We did the Tim Tracker and Adam the Woo. And I don't know why I keep picking bearded guys, but I don't know. <laughs> last year you were a man at least. This year I, I turned you into a woman. But let's see. Let's, see if I let's do this mukbang. This. We've never had a mukbang. We've never done mukbang before, and we have a beard and we have lip fillers on, so it's gonna be kind of hard. <laughs> okay, a little hair in my mouth, but <laughs> how are you doing? <laughs> this is not. <laughs> Not right. What are your plans for Halloween? <laughs> Comment down below. What are your plans for Halloween? What are you doing? What are you dressing up as? Are you gonna dress up as a YouTuber? Are you gonna be Shane Dawson? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. This is too difficult. You got your hair and your lips in the way. Easy peasy. I don't think we're gonna be able to eat. No, we're gonna oh, have to. We're, you're gonna have to take off your lips, probably. Yeah. Want me to rip off your lips? Oh. Wow. <laughs> That's what prosthetic lip fillers look like. Let's get the other one out. We'll keep. We'll keep your little lips over here, close by. <laughs> this is our first mukbang. Yep. We've never done a mukbang before. No. And uh, this is such a classic YouTube thing that I thought it'd be fun to do it on um, Halloween. And dress as YouTube YouTubers. I mean, what else is more perfect? And Trisha Paytas is known as the mukbang queen. And P Peter Mon does does mukbangs too and mm -hmm. loves Trisha. And ideally, in a perfect world, I would love to see Peter Mon and Trisha Paytas do a YouTube collab together. Or at least a mukbang. So, I feel like it's happening. It's coming. So this is why we're doing this because it's we're predicting so the, the future. First, first Peter Mon Trisha. This is we're the, we're the official first Peter Mon and Trisha mukbang before it comes out for real because it's it's happening. I I I'm putting that out into the universe. We already had Shane Dawson and Trisha do mukbangs, and we've already had Shane Dawson meet Peter Mon, and Peter Mon is going to Trisha's show soon. So I have a feeling. Everything's gonna connect, and then we're gonna end up meeting Peter Mon, Trisha Paytas, and Shane Dawson. No. <laughs> well, come to Miami, <laughs> hey, if you ever come to Miami, hit us up. We can. Oh well. Orlando, Peter, if you ever go to Disney right? World. Your boy Peter comes here. Peter Mon, I know you love Sugar Factory. We, I'll link up above a video we did the Sugar Factory. <laughs> if you want, if you're ever in Miami, you can hit us up, and we'll meet you there, and we'll have some rainbow sliders. Oh no, he's vegetarian. So you can have um. What do you eat there, Sugar Factory? We'll have some um, and donuts and we'll have some sugar, sugar so candy. I don't know. And Coco's here. I mean, McBong is over here, hanging out. So Peter Mon has this new channel called Peter Review Stuff, and honestly, I'm loving that channel. I love watching like the the, the one where he carves the pumpkin, mm -hmm. which is something we did not we didn't get to do. We did not no. do a pumpkin this year. We did. Carve. We carved a pineapple, yeah, which is very Miami. Appropriate, but we didn't get around to carving a pumpkin this year, so. But I appreciate your review. Now I know not to buy that 
power saw that they sell for pumpkins. He said it's, it's an electric saw. Yeah, it's a little like electric saw that you buy that's like cheap, but mm -hmm. not worth the money. <laughs> right. He was saying basically it's better to just get like the, the 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 fake the little tools that are cheap, the little tools they sell a little kit. Yeah. You just cut it manually. I had bought one of those because I thought we were gonna do the pumpkin thing, but we never got around to it. We just it? we just we didn't have enough time. This year we did 13 days of Vlogoween, and. I felt like the 13 days flew by. Like next year, I think I want to try 30 days because I think it's it wasn't that difficult. We could have done yeah, all 30. It wasn't that hard. We have extra videos. I thought 13 out. days was gonna be like difficult. Like wow, 13 days in a row. Last year we did vlog. I mean, last year we did vlogmas, and that was our first time posting a video every single day, and that was a, a lot of fun. So then this year, for I decided I want to do vlogween, but let me get a little tiny piece to go. Oh. I think next year we're going to do 30 days because there's so many activities that we could do. There's way more activities to do for Vlogoween than Vlogmas, I think. Mm -hmm. There's not as much Christmas thing. I mean, there are, but like not as much as Halloween related activities. Yeah, when it comes to the little things, candy, pumpkin carving. Yeah, we didn't do any like, makeup, we didn't do candy. like any Halloween. I wanted to do like maybe like a Halloween candy taste test or like makeup looks or, um, Obviously, go to a pumpkin patch and carve a pumpkin. And we didn't even live in a place where there's We wanted to go to a haunted house, too. Yeah. Like a real haunted place. If this video gets more than like 100 views, I'll be happy. <laughs> We're a very small channel, so. Yeah, well. Let's see. You know what's the best video? So far, out of all the videos from Vlogween, surprisingly, the one that has done the best with views is my goodie bag video. Right. Out of all of them, I thought that would be like the one that nobody would watch. I'm like, who cares about watching goodie bag? No, you, surprisingly, that's the best video. I'm like, go figure. It's had the most views. No. I would say first place was the goodie bag video, and then the second video that did well this month was um, the Paranoia Maze. Mm -hmm. Which yeah. which makes sense. That was that one's actually like a good, you know, it's a, it's, a you're showing maze, something yeah. that's worth showing. So comment down below, what's your favorite Halloween movie? <laughs> Why not? Let's get a conversation going. That's what YouTubers do, right? They tell people to like comment down below something. So mm -hmm. comment down below. What are you going to wear for Halloween? Who is your favorite YouTuber? What are you going to watch for Halloween? What's your favorite movie? What's your favorite candy? What's your favorite? <laughs> Just say everything. Just comment all the things. Eating with a beard is definitely... I don't know how men do it. Well, I'm sure they get, you know. Especially with the fuzzy beard, you know? Right. Because your beard is like at least tameable, I mean, but... I know they get food all stuck in it and stuff. Yeah, it has to be. Oh, I have to do a nostril, a nose check. I know that. That's something Peter Mon does. Make sure there's nothing on my nose, right? Yeah, all right. <laughs> he always says to make sure you... That's a, the problems that they, they don't tell you about when you start a YouTube channel. Mm -hmm. So we got a pepperoni pizza. Um, it's not very vegetarian, so technically... Technically, Peter Mon wouldn't eat this. Oh, really? <laughs> no. And Trisha Paytas, I don't know if she likes pepperoni. I think she's a plain cheese person. But we're pepperoni people, so. We haven't had pizza in like six months. I know, that's another thing. We have not eaten a real pizza. We've been having cauliflower crust pizza and like healthy pizzas, but we haven't had a real pizza like, just like this in, in months. I, I don't know how long, but maybe even six months. Or more. <laughs> I mean, I would believe it if it was six months because we just don't ever. We trust me, I love pizza. I wish I could order it every Friday, but I don't know. It's just. It's also like crazy that you spend 20 something bucks on cheese bread and cheese. bread. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. it's not even like. The, the price you're paying for pizza is not even that. Um, I don't know. This is, the value doesn't really add yeah, up. I'm sure they're not using fancy cheese. You know, they're probably not using fancy bread. I wish we had a little a little dog so I could pretend little. he was pee pee. <laughs> little pee pee. Aw. I love when Peter Mon shows like his little dog Captain Pee Pee or what's, what's he call him? Like, I think we call him Captain Pee Pee. <laughs> Sheriff Pee Pee. <laughs> uh uh. I don't know why that's my favorite. That's my favorite dog. <laughs> Very dog of all the YouTubers. Yeah, pee -pee. Captain pee -pee. <laughs> We have a, a dog that we know. Stop it. We call them what? Captain Moo? 
Captain Lou. And yeah. he's like, he looks, he's Louie, and he looks just like Pee Pee, but we couldn't borrow <laughs> him. <laughs> we couldn't get him for today. But that would have been perfect. If I would have ha had Pee Pee and you would have had Coco as, as McBong, and it would have been like, we're two dogs. I'm talking, I'm talking as if I'm talking to them, hoping they're watching this. It would be an honor if you watched, if they're watching, so. Hi, <laughs> if you're watching. I mean, the video we made last year got seen. Right, the YouTubers that we did last year, it was Abu and Tim Tracker, they actually saw the video, which for us was like, awesome, because, you know, that's what you hope for when you're doing these things. You're hoping that the person themselves sees it, because obviously we're fans, you know, but... I mean, I'm a bigger fan, obviously, of Trisha Paytas. I'm, I'm the reason why you know about Trisha Paytas. But recently this year, I discovered Peter Mon and became obsessed with him. And I love Peter Mon. I never realized this YouTube thing was a thing. And so, whatever, I met you. Yeah, I'm the one that was, like, making a big deal about YouTube. And was like, I would love to start a channel, but I don't know how. And then we started watching the Tim Trackers, which is how it all started. And... <laughs> your hair. Might be my, my last piece. We were watching the Tim Trackers and I was talking about how look, you know, we could be like this couple in Miami who just goes around and, and explores things to do and I don't know, that'd be a fun idea and thanks to that it's been a year, it's pretty over a year we've been on YouTube now, so. I mean, I have no idea what we're doing, we're just having fun with it. Yeah. <laughs> But it's definitely, mukbangs are definitely something that I could see maybe us doing sometimes every once in a while. Would it make sense? I mean, we eat food. <laughs> right? Just film it. Yeah, but. Oh, it doesn't have to be junk food or. Or it has to be an abundance. I don't know if people want to watch like a salad a steak, or like. A steak and salad. <laughs> yeah. I think people want to watch like greasy food or like bad food. Mm. Or fast food. People love watching mukbangs of fast food. We can do chicken wings. Or we can do like a burger one whole day. Bunch chicken wings here. We done the chicken wings thing with hot ones. We did the True. hot ones challenge. That's a mukbang. That's a bong. <laughs> well, technically that was our first mukbang. How many have you had? I think my second one. No, really? Maybe. I think so. I think I ate like three or four. I'm going slower because I'm talking and I have a beard. <laughs> Whoa. I'm like, you can have the last one. I'm this is a big one, so you can have that one. Okay. Yeah, I'm not gonna have one more, obviously. Are you sure? You can have that one. So comment down below, I'm curious. <laughs> Do you watch McBongs? Did you click on this because it says McBong in it, or is it because of Peter Mon and Trisha? Or do you just, you like all of that? I don't really watch McBongs unless it's Trisha or YouTubers that I like. I don't watch strangers doing McBongs. What do you watch? It's only two, right? Trisha and every blue, blue, Kelly, Kelly right. Eden does it sometimes. Every blue moon, somebody like Peter Mon has done it once or twice. Like Shane Dawson did it once with Trisha, and I think he did one by himself too. Yeah. All a while back. But yeah, any time that I see a YouTuber do it that I like watching, and they're doing a McBong, I'm gonna watch it. I know Jeffrey Star has done a few. I think Jeffrey Star did one recently with Graveyard Girl. I watched that one. Oh. Um, Tana Mojo, I've watched doing it with Graveyard. Um, Tana Mojo, I've watched her mukbangs with Jeffree Star. So, I've seen quite a few mukbangs, just, but not strangers. Like, you know how it's very popular to watch, like, these strangers and these Asian, I don't know, like, mukbangs where they just eat a massive amount of, like, noodles. Like, right. I don't know if I can get into that. This beard is definitely not easy. <laughs> like, I can't take big bites. I have to be like, yeah, and you get hair. And then on little it. hairs get on it. <laughs> so this beard actually, I bought it online because I couldn't find a beard that looks like his, and I knew painting it on me would be kind of hard because he has he has like white and gray and black hairs, that salt and pepper look <laughs> for yeah. a beard. So I knew that would be hard to paint. Like last year's um, YouTuber that I was had a beard as well, and I ended up painting the beard. But for this one, I decided to buy the beard. But I could not find one that was shaved like small the way that his beard is so I had to try to trim it myself because originally it was a long beard so I had to trim it and <laughs> I still have like loose hairs coming out of the beard because of that and then I bought this icon hat <laughs> on Amazon and I got the mukbang and chill shirt I, I bought that because either way I want to wear it 
But for the video, that'd be perfect. But that's my shirt now. Like I'm wearing that to sleep now. And then the sunglasses were just ridiculous enough that I thought were. I wish I would have found those Gucci sunglasses that looked like more like the ones that she wears. But huh? That way you would have also had to order online yeah. or something. And then the wig was just like a three dollar wig I found at some cheap store. So it's a horrible wig, but you know what? It works. And the lip fillers were pretty expensive actually. Not expensive, but they were like 10 bucks or something. And they were not easy to put on. <laughs> they're the most, they're the worst thing. Like I don't I think I'm, figure it out, I right? couldn't figure out how to put them on. I think they're supposed to like Maybe not those, right? I don't think they're supposed to stick together like that. The mm. two lips were like sticking together and I don't know, making it difficult. Is there still recording? Oh my god, can you imagine it wasn't recording? Oh, we never recorded anything? That would be so sad. <laughs> no, it is recording. I can see it. Well, well the pizza got cold. <laughs> we don't eat the crust. Yeah. Please. Are you a crust eater? Comment down below. <laughs> we don't really eat the crust because it just feels like bread. It's just bread. It is just bread. I mean, honestly, I would if I had like a dipping sauce. You know how Papa John's has those like garlic dipping sauces for the yeah. breadsticks and stuff? Then maybe I would do it. But plain, just plain bread, like I'm not gonna. Well, this is definitely a first. I've never had, I've never eaten a pizza with a beard on. I'm pretty sure you've never had a pizza with a wig on. <laughs> yeah. So we're. We're doing our first mukbang, or first a lot, first a lot of things. Bomb. It'll be fun to think about what we're gonna do next year, but we'll have to wait till it, you know, till it makes sense. This one just popped in my head like a few weeks ago. Yeah, it made sense. Oh, I think I'm gonna go ahead and just like. I hurt. At least I can finish this pizza comfortably with my normal face. Not too really sleepy. That's what happens when you eat pizza. That's why we don't eat pizza very often, because it drags you down. <laughs> but it's Halloween, so perfect excuse to indulge a little bit on pizza. And it's for the video. I just use that as an excuse to order pizza. <laughs> I was like, it's like 1.30 right now. It's perfect. It's the best time of the yeah. day to eat pizza. <laughs> we almost did it for breakfast. Yeah, well. I'm glad we didn't do that. I don't even think pizza places would deliver That's early. true, yeah. Oh, well, this is our first meal of the day. Yeah. So, it's still like kind of like breakfast. <laughs> yeah. So. Well. I guess it does, it's not over until I finish this last slice. <laughs> What's your favorite topping? Comment down below. <laughs> Didn't you already ask that? Did I ask that already? I don't remember. I don't know what else to talk about. I'm a bong, you're supposed to just talk and ramble. Whatever comes out of your brain. Yeah, but we just did that. I've run out, I've run out of things to talk about, so. I'm just gonna enjoy my pizza. All right, so thank you for watching our our mukbang video. I think that was fun, and hopefully someone out there enjoyed it. So, yeah. like, subscribe, and do all the YouTube things. Yeah. And happy Halloween! Happy Halloween! What is muk? Oh wait, hold on. What is it? See you guys tomorrow. See you guys tomorrow. Happy Halloween. <laughs>